And on that Bitcoin Ether note, you know, I see critics pointing to Ether's non-cap supply as a little bit of a weakness when compared to Bitcoin's 21 million fixed supply. How do you respond to concerns there about inflationary design, how Ethereum addresses inflation? I actually think it's a feature, not a bug. The world is a dynamic place. It's not a static place. With Ethereum's disinflationary supply, it actually has a tighter inflation mechanism than Bitcoin. And furthermore, through EIP-1559 and EIP-4844, the Ethereum improvement proposals, basically there is a burning mechanism uh, that is based upon volume on layer one, which is 1559, and layer two, which is 4844. So basically, this could actually burn more Ether faster, uh, which does not happen within Bitcoin. So I actually think the dynamic nature of Ether's supply is, is a feature, not a bug.